Today I'm going to be arguing why Trump is not like Adolf Hitler, no matter what these images say. So let's look at this chart that I found. Uh, cannot find who exactly made this, it's all over the internet. Uh, pretty sure it's kind of old, but you know. Let's look at this chart. So Adolf Hitler used racism to rise to power. Donald Trump uses racism to rise to power. Now, right off the bat, the very first one, they jump into something incorrect. Adolf Hitler, he did use racism to, uh, to rise to power. Uh, more technically, uh, anti-Semitism. But that was only part of how he used... Uh, how he rose to power. It was a very small part. That's how he related to people, and those were his personal beliefs. But, uh, I still think he's a terrible person. Uh, do not support Hitler in any way. I do not think that Hitler should be compared to Trump, because Trump is not anything like like Hitler, uh, and shouldn't, like I said, should not be compared to him. And then it says, Donald Trump uses racism to rise to power. I challenge anyone who agrees with that, to find a quote or a video clip or anything that supports that or shows and proves that Trump is racist or uses racism to rise to power. He opposes illegal immigration. He uh, thinks he does not think that white people are inferior to everyone else and doesn't believe that there should be a white genocide, uh, despite uh, what the New York Times believes. I'm not saying they believe Trump believes that. Nobody believes that. But he most certainly is not a white supremacist. He doesn't think other races are inferior to white people. And my New York Times comparison there, in case you didn't notice, was uh, because they defended their employee who w went on to Twitter uh, a long time ago and started posting anti-white uh, tweets. And I'm not exaggerating with that. Uh, when you call for white genocide and say that all white people are terrible, that is racist. Donald Trump has not said anything similar to that about any race, uh, whether it be white people, African Americans, uh, Mexicans, nobody. He hasn't done that. Proposed mass deportations. Proposes mass deportations. Now, Adolf Hitler, he didn't like anyone that wasn't Aryan. and wanted Jews to be deported, or anyone else. Donald Trump, no, he's, he does, he's not a white supremacist. He doesn't, he's, he doesn't believe that uh, there should be any sort of ethnostate or anything. He thinks that illegal immigrants, people who enter the country illegally, should be deported. Those who enter legally, which is completely possible for anyone of any race and from any country, they can legally enter the United States and are allowed to do so, and Donald Trump does not want to do anything with them and is going to let them stay in the United States. He simply does not want illegals to stay in the United States, and uh, pretty much any president in recent history also agrees with that, and they are not being compared to Hitler. Promised to make Germany great again. Promises to make America great again. Uh, don't see anything wrong with that. Um, any powerful leader should want to make their country great. Any political leader. Uh, if you don't want to make your country great, why are you in power? Why should you be in power? Those are two positive things anti-Jew fascist, and anti-Muslim fascist. Donald Trump was not anti-Muslim. Or, I mean, Donald Trump is not anti-Muslim. 
and he is certainly not a fascist. He has not used any tactics that are fascist, and he does not try to control everyone. Hitler was definitely a fascist, and was definitely anti-Jew. Donald Trump, not anti-Muslim. He does not like illegal Muslims entering the United States because they are illegal and they pose the threat of terrorism. He does not think all Muslims are terrorists. He thinks that illegal immigrants are more likely to be terrorists because they are entering the country illegally and there have been many terrorist attacks by Muslims. Blames Jews for Germany problems. Germany's problems blames immigrants for America's problem. For America's problems. I don't know why I can't speak right now. Hitler did blame the Jews for a large amount of Germany's problems. Donald Trump blames illegal immigrants for a large amount of America's problems. Now, he does not blame immigrants for America's problems. Illegal immigrants. There's the option to enter the country legally. Thought Jews should wear special IDs and thinks Muslims should wear special IDs. That one is just a plain lie about Donald Trump, not about Hitler. Just a plain lie. Find me evidence of that, and I will change my mind. That is all I have to say about this, and I think you understand my point. Uh, you really don't even need any sources to disprove this. You need sources to prove it, and this image offers none. That is all.